Alrighty. So this one is obviously unit 205. I had to start up here because if I didn't, then it would have cut out. But look at these hallways. Like they're very nice, spacious, very well kept. Like very well kept. And the lake is not like fenced off or anything. There's a tiny baby fence around it just to like keep everything in and out of whatever goes in there but the really good thing about this unit like look at this so you have these units right like they're all hanging out next to each other this unit so you're on the second floor no neighbors you have your storage unit here let's see if it can open with this key it doesn't open with that key, but that's a storage unit. <laughs> um, and then you have like this little nook right here that you can also like make your little outside deck area. If you really wanted to, you don't have to, but you see how they decorated the outside of theirs. So yeah, let's take a look inside. You also have a doorbell, so you can make that a ring doorbell if you wanted. So there's just like tiny little paint things right off the bat. There's a place for George in. There are kids upstairs and you can hear them. <laughs> They're screaming. <laughs> and I think the mom's yelling at them. a decent cleaning we'll just do this place very well and honestly a good jar of paint can of paint would just bring it all back together these tiles they're not bad they're a little scuffed up there but I think that's just like surface scuff they're not bad at all. I don't know if you could hear all the noise they're making. I think it's just because the children are being demons. Um, but <laughs> that's currently their situation. And this is where your water heater is. It's relatively new. Let's see. And your air filter. Sorry for zooming in and out. There's just so many reasons to do so. There is like a crack in just one tile. So you may or may not want to change it. It just needs like a tiny little base lift. You could probably, if you really wanted to, you could probably save these cabinets because they're not terrible. And the counter top, top still works until you like really want to move on from this place and then just get rid of it. Windows look good. Dishwasher is just dirty, which defeats the purpose. You do have super tall ceilings in here. Like, I know the other place is like, oh, I kind of feel claustrophobic. But this place probably has, I'd say, about 10 foot ceilings. So it's really good size. And then that would be your dining room area. This they look like real hardwood floors, but it's so hard to tell. I think they might be real hardwood. I don't know. 
maybe engineered, 50-50. They're buckling a little bit in the middle, like this barely even noticeable because these ones have been changed. Or maybe, nope, it's a pattern. So I'm not sure. I honestly don't know. I'm going to say they're real. I'm just gonna vote on that. Over here, this just looks like some paint came off. There's like no water stains or anything. Just looks like they were peeling off some paint. I no longer hear children upstairs, so they must have just been being not great babies for a second. But you do have two lights in here. That's where your TV would go, so you would have like ample room to put even like a sectional or something over there. And then we can go this way. This is where your washer and dryer would be. Washer and dryer has definitely seen its days. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, you probably heard that one. They're stopping. These doors are always nightmares. Look at that. Yeah. Okay. Let me do that. It's definitely by no means a full gut, like no means. Just a good cleaning, paint, carpet like just needs a little bit of touch up and you'll be fine it's always when you have a full-time renter and over here out of this window this just needs to be clean thing. It's like renters don't have vacuums. These closets are great size. Like they're fantastic. You are missing the blinds, I just realized that, in a couple of windows. Almost all of them, actually. But this one opens from the top and the bottom. So that's pretty cool. And you get a water view, that's nice. The windows are just dirty, like in the bottoms, the crevices. And this is the master. Honestly, overall, this is probably the easiest one that you'd have to do. That's not bad. You can replace that probably. This looks like it's from just like humidity. That's nothing. It's just from putting the curtain rod up there. Yeah. 
you get from the closet. Just in my life. The sliding glass door works great. This just needs a power wash. This is the only thing big. And then change that out. And if they let you not have carpet, I would not have carpet because it's just disgusting to have carpet outside. Um, but you probably want to change it. Other than that, this is like a gorgeous place to hang out. Like, look at all this space. And you're like right here, nobody in front of you. You can't really see your neighbors either, which is awesome. Love not having to see people. Let me show you how we got up here. People over there, they have like a whole setup. Y'all can probably do that if you want. But we're just gonna go right down these stairs, which is very convenient. Beautiful entrance. Like, look at this. Your mailboxes are right in front, easy access. Your dumpster is right there, so when you leave, because you could park anywhere along there. So I would assume that you would just park over here because I parked over there to make it easy. Um, you could just take your trash right over there instead of having to haul it like across the parking lot. It's a beautiful building. Yeah. Well, let me know if y'all have any questions.